Why are half a million people waiting out in the cold? What are they waiting for? They are waiting to see the belt, which is one of the sacred relics, the belt of the Virgin Mother. And this is at the Christ the Saviour Cathedral. And literally, as you said, hundreds and thousands of people, up to half a million, have lined up between Thursday and today just to catch a glimpse of this holy relic. Now, it's interesting because you see that there they are and it's sub-zero temperatures. Wow. And they're taking a look. Now, what you're seeing is them touching it, but because there were so many crowds, what they've eventually done is elevated the silver box so that people can just catch a glimpse of it. Mm. But the belt is usually housed in the Vatapedi Monastery on Mount Athos in Greece and it hasn't left Mount Athos in Greece for 200 years so this is the first time it's come to Russia and it was several cities in Russia but came to Moscow on Thursday and between Thursday and Sunday they say up to half a million people have lined up. Now what, why? If, if, if it hasn't left for 200 years why is it well, on a tour now? Well that's interesting it's on a tour now some say that it's showing really good relations between the Greeks and the Russians and there's also another theory behind this, that there's a huge decline in population in Russia. And the belt is supposed to bring fertility. Hmm. So the belt is supposed to heal all ails. It's the belt of fertility. So people who are lining up to see this relic, one gentleman said there's a reason that they're there. They're either ill, so a lot of elderly, yeah. about 87 people were taken to hospital, and many people would like to get pregnant. There were some pregnant women, but the idea is that this belt is so holy by just looking at it or touching wow. your ails will be cured. Is it going on tour anywhere else or this is just... It seems right? that after Moscow it will go back to Greece but what's also ironic is that the monastery in Greece is a male-only monastery and mm. women can never see it. Also ironic is just a wow. couple of hundred meters from this cathedral, the Christ the Saviour Cathedral, is another piece of the same belt that's housed there permanently and yet this has caused such a huge influx of people to visit but this cathedral in the 1930s was destroyed by the soviet government so the fact that it has been rebuilt also shows the increased popularity in russian orthodoxy that is very interesting and again today's the last day today what? is the last day at the christ the savior cathedral a revival of russian orthodoxy and this sacred relic that many believe will bring fertility and wow. increased population in russia declining population rate. So. We shall see you over the next couple of years, huh? Nadia Vilcek, thank you so much.